Hey guys, it's Danny, and today I've got a different kind of haul. Um, I've never um, hauled anything like this before, but it's coffee syrup. <laughs> um, basically, um, I have this one that I buy from Walmart that I like, but... I can only ever really find like three flavors of it and it's vanilla, hazelnut, and caramel. And then sometimes if I'm lucky, I'll find a s'mores flavored one that's really good actually. Um, but I've been looking for different flavors, like I wanted to like branch out, get different flavors. And I saw an advertisement pop up for um, this particular one when I was doing a search like it popped up and I was like okay I've never tried them before but I'll try them and the things I did buy were on sale so I mean like I'll tell you the uh, the prices that they were originally and then like what they were when I bought them and yeah um if I like them I'll talk about them some more and you know say oh were they worth it you know were they not um if I'd buy more and first one I am going to show is this one and it is Christmas cookie flavored. It was a limited edition flavor and it is sold out now, but I paid $3.99 for this bottle. And it's a really large bottle. It's um 25.4 fluid ounces. And it settled a little bit on the bottom, but you can see it's like this milky kind of white color. So it's like sugar cookie flavored. This was, like I said, it was on sale for $3.99. Um, and like I said, it is 25.4 fluid ounces and it, um, originally all bottles the size of this particular brand are, um, $6.99. This is called Jordan's Skinny Syrups. They're zero calorie, zero sugar. Um, so there's no calorie, no sugar, no fat, no cholesterol, no sodium, no carbs, there's absolutely nothing in here at all. Like if you look at the label, there is nothing. And I do not like coffee. Um, unless I'm getting a Frappuccino from Starbucks, I don't drink coffee. And even then, you know, I don't even know if there's coffee in some of those. Because if there is, you really can't taste it at all. But anyway, um, but I like tea. When I, the way I grew up, like how my family was, when we have hot tea, we put milk and sugar in our hot tea. And sometimes it gets a little bit boring. So what I have done before and what I do now is I like to put coffee creamer, like Coffee Mate, in my hot tea. So that way I can try all the cool flavored creamers and stuff like that. Well, I would like to cut back a little bit on that because I don't, I use, I do not use just a serving of creamer, which is like a tablespoon. I use like, you know, that much creamer. I use a lot of creamer. Um, and I think that it would be better, like a good way to cut calories if I stopped using creamer. And started using like something like this instead to flavor that has no calories or anything in it to sweet well maybe sweeten i'm sure this is sweet but to um sweeten and flavor my tea and then just add like a splash of milk for a little bit of creaminess be a good way to cut down the calories and you know still get my fix what i do think is really cool about this particular one is there's a list of ways you can use it on the back of the bottle and there's even a little recipe for cocoa I just did that so you guys could read it, but basically it just says you add a tablespoon of the syrup to a mug and fill it with your favorite sugar-free hot chocolate. So yeah, so this is really cool. And to go with it, I also bought a pump. This was also $3.99 and that's like regular price for this pump. Um, if you buy the full-size bottles, you have to get the gold pump because that's the one that's for the size bottle. 
and it does say right here that one pump is half of a tablespoon so that's pretty cool and on the back of here it does say that the the serving size is one fluid ounce so a serving size would be two pumps because a half a tablespoon no wait that's wow okay so one fluid ounce it says here that a, a half a tablespoon one pump equals half a tablespoon or one fourth of a fluid ounce so four pumps is a serving and I don't know how strong that would be I'd have to fiddle around with it when I actually try it I will tell you guys for that and like I said I got a pump it's just a regular old pump now these these are like I said these are $3.99 each but I'm thinking that after I use it I could probably clean it like take it out of the bottle like put it in a cup of water and pump water through it I could probably clean it out so you know what I mean so if I really liked it and I wanted to get another big bottle maybe not of that flavor but like a different flavor whatever I can like maybe not buy so many pumps or have to buy so many pumps the next thing I got is this little duo it's called the cozy coffee collection and it comes with two bottles you get cinnamon dolce and s'more I'm gonna take these out because these are smaller this was like this was on sale I think originally it was like nine dollars and it was on sale for like seven something so these bottles I'm gonna take them out really quick these bottles as you can see are smaller this one is only, they're only 12.7 so for size comparison this is a full-size bottle and this is a mini bottle and like I said this one's $6.99 full price for any flavor of this size these ones they don't sell unless you are getting like the little collections like this is the cozy coffee collection and then they have another one that's like a caramel collection that's got like three different like caramel flavors that they have that are the littler bottles and they have they have a few different like trio duo trio things like this um what i liked about this one is this was a duo but it came with the pump for the mini bottles some of the other um the other trios came with three bottles, but they didn't come with a pump. This is the only duo, but it came with a pump. The pump for this one like, is a black one. So if you buy the trios with the littler bottles, you have to make sure you get the black topped pump. And also these are $2.99 a piece if you buy them separately. So I got the cinnamon dolce flavor and I got s'mores flavor in that little kit. Um, I have a s'more, a bottle of s'mores flavored syrup from the other brand I was talking about earlier. I have that in my pantry right now. Um, so once I get this one open and everything, I'm going to kind of compare the two and see, oh, this is this one better, that one better, whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, this one is the one I really wanted to try the most, the cinnamon dolce. And I wanted to try it the most because... I really like getting a vanilla bean frappuccino from Starbucks and putting the cinnamon dolce in it, like getting a couple pumps of that in it, and it tastes like cinnamon toast crunch. So I really hope this is really good. If this one's good, I can totally see myself buying a full-size bottle if I really, really like it. The s'mores one, I probably won't get um, another one of unless I absolutely positively love it. But like I said, I've got a lot of other... I have... I'll this bottle now and a full other bottle of a different brand of s'mores flavored syrup but um so like I said this is called Jordan's skinny syrups they have a ton of different flavors and not just like sweet like for coffees they also have ones that are just fruit flavored like cherry or strawberry apple you know like cotton candy you know because they also have they say you know you can use these syrups for like mixed drinks like if you're trying to like flavor like alcoholic drinks or any kind of anything like that. They're not just for coffee, but they have that stuff too. And then the last thing I bought 
is this pack of straws. These are just metal straws. These are metal iridescent rainbow straws. And it was a four pack. And this was five bucks for four straws. And I've been wanting to get some more metal straws. And here's what they look like. They seem pretty long, but like they're a pretty good size and they're really iridescent. I like that a lot. I um I really like metal straws. I use I have some Jeffree Star ones that I use a lot. Um, because I really like them. And they're paint. Um his his do chip. Um mine haven't really chipped all that much at all. Like they're very, very little, but I hand wash my straws. I don't put them in the dishwasher. I know some people do, and then they complain that the paint comes off, but it says on them that you're not supposed to put them in the dishwasher. But that's just me. Um, so I know a lot of people complain that Jeffree Star ones, like, chip. The paint chips off, but I've never had that problem. Um, these ones I don't think the paint will chip off, because I don't know if this is paint or if the metal is actually just this color. So, But I got some more straws, so I'm happy about that. I've been meaning to get some more metal straws. And so that's everything I got. I will... When I start like using them and stuff, um, I do, like I said, I want to compare this to the other s'mores one I have. Um, and then this one I'm excited about. I hope it doesn't taste like crap because sometimes stuff that tastes like sugar cookie tastes like ass, but I love sugar cookies. So I'm always down to try it even though I have been burned in the past. But I really hope this brand is good, especially because they've got... A million flavors I think on the website it boasted that they have like 50 plus flavors and like they have some really interesting ones um, like they have a glazed donut one and that I really want to try um, they have like a fudge dipped waffle cone flavor like what like so many different cool flavors and I really really want to try them so I really hope these are good and like I said I was a little bit, um, like $7 for one, like, dude, what, but these are so big. Like I said, they're 25.4 ounces and they're $6.99. That's pretty good. And then, like I said, they've got a couple different trios and duos and stuff. You can also get where you get smaller bottles. All right. So that is what I got. That's my, my video. Um, I'll let you guys know once I actually try these. And also, just quick, um, the best buy date on this one is 10-8-2022. So this has, I have over a year to use these. So that's really, really great. I don't know if these little ones have it. Okay, the expiration date on the littler bottles is 9-7-22, or 17-22. So... A little less time but still you know over well over a year to use all of these syrups I think I can do it all right I'll talk to you later bye